I want you to smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, and click on the description below so that you get put on our mailing list. And my latest YouTube channel for Epic Times has now been demonetized, as was the first one. First one had over 575,000 subscribers, demonetized. So we started another one. Figured maybe we could do something uh, a little bit different so we wouldn't be flagged and tagged. Well, it was growing. Got to 177,000 last time I looked. Dead stop. It is now demonetized as well. And you'll see in the description below how you can make a donation uh, to my show to keep everything afloat, to make sure that we keep bringing you hard-hitting videos that tell the truth. Okay? Again, click on the like button, click on subscribe, and make sure you sign up for our newsletter and also throw a little something in the tip jar. I have a pretty diverse staff. Uh, if you're scoring diversity, inclusion, and equity, uh, you'd give my staff uh, 10 out of 10. We have one staffer who's a white male. His name is Noah. Great guy. And from time to time, we'll watch videos where a white guy is assaulted, accused of systemic racism. And I say, Noah, as our token white guy on the staff, how do you feel about this? How do you feel about that? How do you feel about a large number of Americans believing that you are inherently racist? You, because of the color of your skin, do not like black people. When, in fact, you know who you are, you would not hang around with anybody who is racist. You don't even know anybody who's racist. Most people couldn't tell you somebody who's racist, yet you're accused of this. And I said to him, how do you feel about that? And I mentioned to him, have you noticed often in commercials, the black guy is the all-knowing guy and the white guy is a dumb sap, as was the case with this commercial involving, involving Andy Samberg and Snoop Dogg. Question for you, Snoop D O double G. What are we doing today? Just living the fine life, baby. Great. I love that. Just blocking off my calendar. Let me hold that real quick. Yeah. The best plans are no plans. You know what, Snoop D O double G? I think you might be right. I know I am, Andy. And you can just call me Snoop. You got it, Snoop. Dale Double G. So Andy Samberg is the doofus and Snoop Dogg is the wise, all-knowing, street-savvy guy. So I mentioned this to Noah and he said, I've never noticed it. I said, get out of here. Over the years, I've seen commercial after commercial after commercial where the white guy is the dupe. Uh, and the black person or persons are the all-knowing, cluing in the hapless white guy. So I go online, and there's a video having commercial after commercial after commercial demonstrating this very thing. Watch this. This is Jeremy. Jeremy and his team just completed a project that had executives awkwardly offering up fist bumps uh, and uh, high fives. Yeah. They were on cloud nine, but that was yesterday. Today, those same executives are pushing for the next big thing. Something smarter, faster, better. Something the industry has never seen before. Don is stressing out big time, but not Jeremy. Jeremy isn't worried because his team has Pluralsight. He knows what technology skills his team needs to meet the company's goals, and Pluralsight makes gaining those skills as easy as grabbing a snack from the candy wall. The team starts with adaptive skills tests. It takes just five minutes to get their results. Based on their scores, they get a recommended starting point in a path, saving them time because now they know exactly what they need to learn. At lunch, Jenny freshens up with a few courses. She loves knowing she's learning from industry experts with real world experience. Jeremy has strong foundational knowledge, but takes some advanced courses to expand his skill set. Don flies his drone around the office for most of the afternoon, but he dives deep on his commute and continues learning at home. When Jenny comes across a particularly challenging concept, she requests a mentor right from Pluralsight. Within minutes, she's not only unstuck, but she's found a solution that can make those executives' dreams a reality. Jeremy and his team return to the office with a newfound confidence, feeling smarter than yesterday. With Pluralsight, there's nothing this team can't achieve. Go team. So the awkward white guy trying to high five, trying to fist bump, he's completely clueless. Everybody else, including the all knowing black guy, well, they know what to do. You see it over and over and over again in a country that supposedly is systemically racist. Now, guess what I have in my baby brown libertarian hands? That's right, my pillow, my slippers. 
I don't have the pair on right now, otherwise I would doze through the show. Call the number on your screen or go to MyPillow.com promo code ELDER and order a pair for yourself. These are so soft and they also have a nice firm bottom of the feet. They look amazing. Uh, I'm about ready to go to sleep. Nice fuzzy interior and they come in different colors. And then, guess what else the Great Elder Risky has? Oh my goodness! The Giza Dream Sheets. I've been telling you about them. Made from the finest cotton in the world. And they went all over the world to find the best cotton in the world, which is made in Egypt. Again, MyPillow.com. There are over 100 products. 100. I kid you not. And MyPillow.com. Make sure you use promo code ELDER or call the number on the screen. Finally, you know what I'm going to do next. I know you know what I'm going to do next. Oh, what does he have here? He's got a my pillow standard size although they come in smaller sizes and larger sizes and this is really quite fluffy quite an experience i sleep on one every single night so mypillow.com promo code elder or call the number on the screen you will not regret it i'll be right back here's another one you know 7-Up goes great with punch, but try mixing it with fresh cut fruit and sangria. It's the perfect drink for when you go raving in the desert. Like that time you told your wife you were at the regional sales conference. Wait, what? what? Remember last March with Steve? <laughs> or use it to make a white wine spritzer. Perfect for hanging out with 2 chains. I love your rap music. I have a helicopter. Ooh. We should be going. You don't like boats? I like boats. And I love all these 7-Up mixed drinks. 7-Up, mix it up a little. The uh, black guy has a helicopter, he's smooth, he's got a woman, hapless white guy, once again. Are you noticing a theme here? Here's another one. <laughs> Dude, so not cool. Mmm, nacho cheese. Dude, so not cool. Have you noticed a trend here? Hey, are you gonna finish those? Sorry, they're already gone. No, they're not. You left the best part. No, I'm pretty sure they're... Mmm, cheese. I love Doritos. <sighs> Doritos! Two nerdy white guys. Not just one, but two. Double the pleasure. Here's another one. So what can I get you guys today? Uh, actually, do you mind telling me the specials again? Dude, it's been over this already. Three bean chili with garlic bread, a Cajun chicken salad with a raspberry vinaigrette, or a pulled pork sandwich with fries or mixed greens. Wow, that's hot. What's hot, the chili or the chicken? There's nothing hotter than a guy who listens. Find yours on LiveLinks. Call or visit LiveLinks.com for your local number. Intelligence, 18 plus. Nothing hotter than a guy who listens. Black guy who listens. Nothing nerdier than a white guy who doesn't who's shown up by the all-knowing, more sophisticated black guy. Let's do one more, shall we? Well, the car is great. Just show me the Carfax. Carfax, let me do you one better. This old guy can sniff out any problems. He's not gonna help. You wanna see the accidents and service records reported to Carfax and a price based on the car's history. Yeah, just show me the Carfax. But nothing gets past this old bloodhound. <laughs> Before you buy a used car, just say, show me the Carfax. Just, just show me the Carfax, uh, says the black guy. And the white salesman, yeah, I don't know what a Carfax is. I don't know. Over and over and over again. And again, Noah hadn't noticed it. Part of it is his personality. He's not looking around for slights, not looking around for people to be attacking him. But I noticed it. And certainly if it were the other way around, believe me, the woke community would have come down on these commercials like a hammer. Now, as you know, you can call the show. 888-971-SAGE, 888-971-7243. 
leave a message, make sure it is under 59 seconds, and try to avoid the profanity. And by the way, if you look at those commercials, there are two instances where the word occasionally was, was, was misspelled. We didn't do it. They did. So don't write me an angry letter telling me that I misspelled the word occasionally. I know how to spell it occasionally, but whoever did that did not. I don't know whether or not the person that did that is white or black or what have you. All I know is that it was misspelled. Let's go to the phones, shall we? Hello, Mr. Overlord Eldersky. I have a question regarding uh, the events with uh, President Biden's interview with 60 Minutes last night, where he says one thing, and then the White House says, oh, no, no, that's not true. Who's actually in charge, the president or the swamp? Uh, I think that's sort of something that needs to be addressed. Uh, thank you. You are quite well, You're quite welcome. Well, you know the answer to that. What he said on the 60 Minutes interview is that the pandemic is over. And because the left has used the pandemic to enact all sorts of rules and regulations, including changing voting rules and regulations, they need the pandemic. In fact, there's a video of, uh, of Biden appearing not to know where he is, what he's doing. Mr. President, thank you. At the end of such a momentous event, the word thank you seems kind of inadequate. But for all the millions whose lives will be saved, for the communities where life will be transformed, thank you. So thank you, President Biden, for your outstanding. Uh, where is the man going? Phone call number two, please. Hope you enjoyed that video. The full show is available to watch right now on Epoch TV. Just click the link in the description below to learn more because we've got a country to save.